Hello my lovely friends, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here and love nail art, you should subscribe to this channel as I post step by step tutorials to easy DIY nail art ideas twice every week. And don't forget to click on the bell icon so you get notified as soon as I post a new nail art video. Today's nail art video is for my friends who struggle to have a stable hand just like I do sometimes when I am nervous. So you don't need to worry about your shaky hands as this nail art idea is just the perfect one for you to try out. So without making you wait further, let's get started with the tutorial. For this nail art design, I am going to be making my middle finger nail as well as the ring finger nail as my accent nails. So I went ahead and painted them in this beautiful coral nail polish. Don't worry, I will list down all the details of the products I have used for this nail art in the description box below. Then I went ahead and painted my other nails in this gorgeous navy nail polish. Once my base layers are dried off completely, I created a couple of random dots in navy color using this toothpick. Don't worry, the dots need not to be exactly round in shape. As you can see, I am intentionally moving the toothpick after placing the dot a little bit to make sure the dots are not exactly in the round shape. Leave some space between each of these bigger dots so they all look evenly spread. Repeat the same step on the ring finger nail as well, like so. It is a good idea to create few of the dots at the edge halfway through as this is going to make the nail art look even more realistic. Now I am using this gorgeous orange nail polish to fill in the spaces by creating even more dots but this time the size of the dots is smaller than the ones I created previously. Don't go overboard and fill in almost all the spaces but you can always change the sizes of these orange dots like I am doing here. I have placed couple of medium sized dots and then a few in even smaller size than that. Repeat the same step on both the nails to complete this part of the design. Now I am using this black nail polish to create even smaller dots than the previous ones. In my previous video, I have explained and given few tips of how to create dots in different sizes using the toothpick. So if you are interested to learn that, make sure to watch that video. I will link that video right above or you can also click on the link in the description box. Repeat this step on both the nails to make them look similar. Next up, I am going to use this beautiful green nail polish from Elansa and I am going to create some wiggly lines like so. As you will notice that I am creating these lines in various different sizes as well as I am going to create them at various different places on the nail. These wiggly green lines are going to add that touch of abstract art and a pop of color to this nail art. If you would have seen my other videos on my channel, you will know that I always try to share nail art ideas that are really easy to create but they all look very elegant, classy and unique. So if you haven't subscribed yet, please, please, please subscribe to my channel so you never miss out on these easy DIY nail art ideas. The final step as always is to clean your edges and apply a good layer of top coat to make your manicure look shinier and last for a longer period of time. I am really impressed with how this design has finally turned out. It looks abstract elegant and so chic. Let me know in the comment section below what do you think of this nail art design. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!